what's going through your head like before a slip knot concert, like when you're in the huddle? I know we'll like never understand, but can you explain that to me? What's going through my head before a slip knot show? I'll build it up towards the huddle. How about that? Um, that's the question that's on the floor. Let me explain to you just what kind of process leads to a very fucked up show like a slip knot show. <laughs> About an hour to stage time, I make my way into the dressing room, and uh, I spend 10 minutes talking myself into the fact that I have to put that stinky son of a bitch on. <laughs> About 20 minutes after that, I start putting on black makeup to, you know, do a little shading, a little, you know, theatrical weirdness, and we call it Absu, named after a black metal band from Texas that sent a, uh, an 8x10 to Sean's bar, to Clown's bar back in the day, and it was the funniest fucking picture we'd ever seen. <laughs> they were all in someone's basement, and you could see, like, mom and dad's schnick schnacks in the background, <laughs> and they're all in corpse paint, and they're all in leather, and they're all like, <laughs> I mean, like, there's four of them, but then there's fucking mom's Muppet collection. <laughs> Just in the background. <laughs> and we were like, Absu is awesome. <laughs> so we started calling the black makeup Absu. So I'm putting that crap on, knowing full well it's going to take me like three hours and some chiseling to get it off after the show. So I'm like, okay, we'll put it on so heavy today. <laughs> and I ended up doing it anyway. After that, I started putting on the rig. And uh, on this last run, we were doing the red coveralls. So that was a lot like trying to put a diaper on over your head. <laughs> because they're all, they're so misshapen. Like, I, I don't know if you've ever worn a pair of coveralls. Yeah. They're, not, they're not developed for comfort or style. <laughs> it's just, it's open in the areas that you really don't need it to be. And then snug <laughs> in the areas that really, really are not very complimentary. Especially in a cold day. I start fucking getting into that summer, bitch. Ugh. Zip it up. Now, there's about 10 minutes for me to start warming up and shit, which um, I got a, kind of a sore throat, but I will do my very best impersonation of my warming up. <laughs> Bowling 
don't sound anything like that. <laughs> Anytime I hear him, it just, it just gets me going. But um, we hug each other, and then we all bring it in. And we take a second, we kind of focus the energy in. And uh, because we know what we're going to do is uh, a little different, a little fucked up. <laughs> And it's just awesome. a special, special place that we have to go to when we go there, you know? And we do it together. And as soon as we're done in that huddle, we are not nine people anymore. We're one band. And that's what's very special about it.